So guys, for the first step, you want to get into this screen. Now to get into this screen, there's going to be two ways I'm going to show you. And now for the first way, this is if you can sign into Windows. So if you can sign into Windows like me, I'm on Windows right now. You want to head over to search and type in reset this PC. Click on it. And the next advanced startup, you want to click on restart now. And I click on restart now again. It will then take you into that screen. And now for the second way, this is if you cannot sign into Windows. If you cannot sign into Windows, then you want to turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. When you see the Windows loading screen, you want to turn it off again and then turn it back on again. You want to repeat this three times. So you want to turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. When you see the Windows loading screen, you want to turn it off again and then turn it back on again. Repeat this three times and it will take you into here. It's going to take you into this screen. It's going to be seeing that your PC did not start correctly. You want to click on advanced options, which will then take us into here. And then once we're here, you want to click on troubleshoot. Advanced options and then command prompt. If you do not see command prompt, you want to click on see more recovery options and then it should be right here. So now you want to click on command prompt and now once you're on this, you want to type in boot rec space forward slash fix mbr. Click on enter and then you want to type in boot rec space forward slash fix boot. Click on enter again. For me, it says access denied because I do not have this problem but for you, it should be working. If you see any more errors on my screen come up, it's because I do not have this problem but in your case, it should be working. And now you're going to type in bcd edit space forward slash export space c colon backslash bcd backup. Click on enter. And now you're going to type in attrib space c colon backslash boot backslash bcd space dash h space dash r space dash s. Click on enter. And now you're going to type in ren space c colon backslash boot backslash bcd space bcd dot old. And click on enter again. And now you want to type in boot rec space forward slash rebuild bcd. Click on enter. Wait for this to load. And now once this comes up, you want to type in y and then click on enter. And then for the last command, you want to type in exit and click on enter again. Now you just want to go back to Windows and then the problem should be fixed.